Hello everyone, uh, welcome back to Transport Fever 2. Uh, this is the Stepford map, right? Uh, so last time around we were doing um, uh, building materials, or construction materials, or con mats, or whatever, right? So uh, this time around, uh, what I want to do is uh, continue the uh, con mats quest, because we've got another couple of uh, con mats chains that we can put together. So uh, the first one we're going to do is uh, the Joliet Quarry number two, the Springfield Conmats plant, and send that to Lilliput. Yeah. Um, and uh, that looks like it'll be pretty straightforward. Uh, we can run a train through here, and then a truck line into Lilliput directly, I think. So uh, I think the first thing to do is... Uh, stick a couple of stations in right uh, so uh, we're going to stick a uh, cargo station eh, let's make it a uh, terminus no cat catenary catenary whatever uh, now let's um, get over here so we can see what's doing oh come on can we get Okay, what's it doing? Uh, okay. Collision? Why is it colliding? There we go. Oh. No. Let's um let's do one of these. Okay. Now we'll uh no, we'll turn it around here and turn this around. Uh, can we get a, come on, there we go, we got it to finally, uh, uh connect, so that's Joliet Quarry number two, whoops, Quarry number two, yeah, Good. And then over here, we're going to uh, need another uh, station. We'll just put another one of those. Uh, we'll always, of course, turn things around the wrong way. Uh, that's uh, Springfield Construction Materials, right? Uh, construction Materials Plant. Yeah. Okay, now we need to get a rail line through there. Now, uh, let's just, uh, grab the rail. And again, no electrification. Now, let's, uh, let's see if, if we crow flies it. Yeah, we don't quite get down far enough, do we? Uh, yeah, we don't. Okay. But if we come around, huh? So I think we'll have to helix that. Okay. Well. What if we uh, start by going full down bubble that way? Yep. And then we come around, uh, I don't know, over here. Uh, right. Well, uh, let's uh, let's do that and then see what we get. Okay, that allows us to come out over here at maximum down bubble. Now, that allows us to connect. Okay, good. 
that gets a connection. Right. Okay. So that was uh, that was relatively straightforward, really. I don't really like the uh, let's put the whole thing underground effect we have going here. Um, how far underground is it? I don't think it's as far underground as as it uh, necessarily looks. I do. Okay, I do want to uh, reconnect that. If I do that, yeah, I think I can live with that. So we come up to here. And that is definitely uh, low enough down that, uh, yeah, we'll uh, just uh, wang that around like that. Yeah. Okay, so we're going to need one of these. Yeah. And one of these. Good. Um, that's not as bad as it might have been. Uh, right, okay. Uh, put the signals on. So we'll put, put one here. I don't know, we'll put one here. And maybe one over here. And I guess... Yeah, over here seems like a good spot. And I guess we need one more, say, about here. And then we'll uh, stick one in about here. Yeah. Okay, so that definitely gets us a, uh, a connection point. Let's get rid of that. Uh, okay. Now we're going to need to bring also bring it into Lilliput. So uh, we're going to need a road and we're going to need a building and we're going to need a truck drop-off point. And it looks like we're dropping it off about here. Yeah, it seems about right. Okay, so we'll drop it off there. I'm going to need one of these uh, with a single platform, right? We'll put it, I don't know, here. And we'll also call this the uh, Springfield Construction Materials Plant, right? Uh, so, Construction Materials Plant. Yes, good, right, okay. We need roads. Uh, we'll go with this one. We'll put a curve on it. And we'll do this. What if we do this? Yeah, we'll do that. Okay. Well, that does seem to be pretty straightforward. Now, uh, we also need one of these, which we can stick, I don't know, over here. Yeah, we'll stick it back here just because. Uh, we'll run that down like that. Yeah. Okay. Uh, right. And we're gonna need to we're gonna need a rail depot as well, so we'll grab a rail depot. And I don't know. I guess we'll uh, we'll stick it down at this end. Yeah, we'll stick it down here. Um, we'll face it this way because we can, right? Uh, we'll uh, do this. And then this. Good. Okay. That gives us uh, everything we need to fling transport at this, I think. So let's start with here. And we'll buy uh, cargo. We'll buy our uh, favorite um, man trucks. Uh, yeah, we'll grab the tarpaulin one. We'll put five of them, just because. And we'll uh, do a new line. We'll go here to here. Yeah, that looks well, looks pretty solid. Okay, so cargo truck from uh, Springfield uh, Conmat to uh, Springfield. Yeah, okay. Good. Now, we're going to need to also fling a train at this. 
Well, we'll go with diesel. And we'll go with our trusty SD40. Yeah. Yeah. And we'll go cargo. And we're going to need uh, a gondola. We'll grab that that one. One, two. No! I keep doing that. Uh, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Yeah. We only need one of those. Buy it. New line. Goes here to here. Yeah. Cargo rail. Joliet Quarry 2 to SPFL Conmat. Yeah. Okay. Good. Now, let's uh, let's just take a uh, take a look in on here. Seems like the thing to do. We'll just take a look in on here. I just want to see what this uh, this line looks like because we know it's going to work. Well, this line coming out of the depot kind of works. There's our town over there. Oh look, there's traffic on the road. Yeah, I really want to see uh, how egregious this cut looks. They really need to do something about trees on things like that. Uh, but yeah. Okay. That eh, could be worse. And then here's our massive tunnel. I could push the tunnel back just a little bit by the look of it, but I'm not going to. That's too much fiddling, right? Uh... Okay, where are we uh, here? We've got uh, the massive curve, and then we come up for a curve the other way. And into the station, and everything's good, right? Yeah, it's not, not terrible. Yeah, that's tolerable. Okay. Uh, so far, so good. Now, we have a second uh, CONMATS uh, production scheme over here that we can bring into Townsville. So, um, right. This one's going to be a little more challenging. And I think it's going to be road all the way on this this one. Yeah, I think so. Because we've got this, uh, we've got a fairly non-trivial height difference there, I think. Uh, here. So that, uh, that one... Yeah, there's a pretty substantial bit of height difference in a short distance distance there by the look of it. So what I'm going to do is, uh, I guess, I'll, no, I want road. I'm going to do this one with road. Okay, so building. Uh, no, this one. Yeah. So we're going to stick a station here. like that and we're going to you know what I'm gonna do I'm going to add platform length there yeah just because I can right and we're gonna go over here we're going to add a uh, platform thingy on here 
Uh, that'd be otherwise known as a station. And it's going to be angled like that. Yeah. Just like that. And we're going to do the platform thing on here too. Now do we still have... No, we don't. Uh, okay. Well, let's see. Uh, cargo platform. Okay. That will get us uh, a tendril. Okay, good. Uh, okay. We need also uh, one of these over here. Yeah, okay. So as you can see, we've got uh, a massive up swing that we have to do there so uh, yeah that's definitely going to be fun now let's grab our roads and see about getting through or around we're gonna have to go through this but let's see uh, no we're gonna do this right and then we're going to do this. And we're going to do maximum up bubble, can we? Yeah, we can do a maximum up bubble there and uh, bring this in around here, I think. Yeah, we'll do that. Now, uh, while I'm thinking about it, I'm going to grab this. And I'm going to grab the smoothing. Uh, we're going to... Gonna going to smooth this out a little bit. Uh... Yeah, that looks less bad. Okay, good. Uh, now we can, we're going to have to punch through. Okay, so we punch through. Okay, yeah, like that. Good. Now, if we crow fly it and do this, yeah, we can do the same thing again, I think. So we bring this out. Uh, right. Okay. Now these types of huge embankments on roads are not actually all that unrealistic uh, when you uh, get down to it. I've actually seen a few like this in the uh, mountains around, uh, you know, and, and river valleys. Yeah, yeah, that's, uh, that's tolerable. Okay. Now, the question is, what am I gonna, what am I going to do for the road coming out here? Well, uh, we're going to have to maximum up bubble it, of course. Uh, so we'll do that. And this. Okay. Now, question is, where do we need to put our drop-off point here? Uh, building. One of these. We need it over here, by the look of it. Yeah, over there. Okay. Well, 
street. Okay. I could come up here. Yeah. That looks like it's fine. Then we upgrade this. Upgrade this too. Yeah. Upgrade this. Yeah. Okay. Uh, that should be fine. Now we'll uh, we're gonna put the uh, the depot thing over here. Uh, I'm gonna put it. I don't know. We'll put it right here. And uh, I guess this should get one of these. Uh, connect in there. Uh, We don't want it to be uh, used for regular um, road traffic, and we don't want it to be used for uh, the town to extend roads from. Okay, well now let's um, just uh, do this. Yeah, okay, that looks just a little less bad. Yeah, just a little less. Okay. Now, we need to uh, buy a truck or two, right? Um, again, we'll go with our favorite here. And I think I'm going to put 15 on here. Why? Because it's a fairly long route, and why not? Uh, okay, so we'll do a new line, which will go from here to here to here. Yep. Okay, and that's cargo truck, and that's going to be, uh, that's the uh, Lilliput, and then Townsville. Okay. Uh, CT Lil, uh, Quarry to... T Townsville. We'll just call that town. Uh, Conmat to town. Okay. Now we're going to grab a truck. We're actually going to ride the truck and uh, just observe what's going on here. So we have a. Uh, Ah, I see. This is going to be uh, potentially uh, traffic uh, mangling here. Yeah, what I what I'm going to need to do on that road into town probably is put uh, bus lanes on there. Why didn't put bus lanes? But anyway, we're coming down to the factory. Yeah, it looks okay. We drive through the station, because why not? I think I've got something that's using up CPU power or something on this, uh, on the machine, because this is a little jumpier than uh, it should be. And here we go along the road, our nice uh, embankment here. And we're, we head up for the tunnel through the mountain. Yeah, there's no way we we're going over that. Not realistically. I could have, uh, but it just seems like the tunnel is actually cooler. Okay, the tunnel isn't that long. Yeah, the tunnel's perfectly reasonable. Uh, the cr crest of the hill is... Uh, looks like it's right at the edge of the tunnel. And then we head down. Ooh, this is uh, exciting. <laughs> Can you imagine driving an actual truck on that 
coming down that hill. Oh, there's the train we just uh, flung up there in the distance. Oh, could you imagine that? That would be uh, frightening, wouldn't it? Um, yeah. It'll take a while for these trucks to spread out, right? Let's uh, jump out of this one and we'll grab uh, this one. Oh, come on. Um, ride that one coming out. Oh yeah, this is terrifying. It's awesome. Uh, could, could you imagine driving this road? Um, yeah. Uh, actually, I can. I've been on roads just like it, but uh, yeah. Uh, that was terrifying coming down that that curve uh, looking into the valley there that was that was that was great uh, right so we this doesn't look half bad oh yeah that that's ooh, that looks nice the trees there right want to see what it looks like when we come out the other side so that should be uh, somewhat uh, entertaining as well. We picked up 17 uh, stone. So we've got a full load of stone here. Now coming out the other side. This shouldn't be too terrifying. Yes, yeah, so we got the forest here, right? And then, uh, oh yeah, here's our uh, drop-off point for the stone. Right. get here, we drop it off. We won't pick any up, I don't think. Uh, okay, we drop off the 17. Yeah, we're not picking any up. But the next next truck should. Um, I wanted to see what this hill climb here looks like. I do wish the uh, roads coming out of the stations would line up a little bit better with the actual roads so you don't get that wiggle on the way out because that slows the traffic down, right? Uh, and it's not necessary. So we climb up. We come around. And then we make our turn. Okay. Yeah. Okay. So that's cool. Um, okay, so what I'm going to do is proactively turn this. No, I'm not. It doesn't look like there's heavy enough traffic there just yet. Okay, I'll leave that alone. I'll leave well enough alone. So anyway, that's Townsville. Now, uh, yeah, we're picking up some con mats there. Okay, so that's the Townsville operation. Uh, we got planes and a uh, Chinese uh, a train thing. Okay, so we have that. Uh, so let's um, let's just call up the uh, industry list. Uh, right. So we'll make it big. Uh, we'll sort by product. Uh, so product we want con mats. One, two, three, four, five. They are all... Uh, we almost... Ha we have a fair chunk of everything uh, connected up. So we have farm... Okay, let's... Um, let's look at shipment. So the zero ones. We have... Uh, a machines factory in Zion. Uh, a food processing plant in San Angeles. Uh, a tools factory in Moss Eisley. Uh, Duckburg Fuel Refinery. 
We have two food processing plants. We have one in Dog River. Um, we have uh, a sawmill in Zion. Uh, okay, we got a uh, oil refinery in Joliet. Okay, and uh, a steel mill. Uh, another sawmill and a plastics uh, operation. Hmm. Okay, so I think we're short a uh, oil refinery. Uh, yeah, I think we're short an oil refinery uh, on the map. But anyway, that gives us... Uh, this gives us... Uh, Okay, so we've got uh, iron, 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 coal, coal, coal. Uh, okay, so we have too many uh, iron and coal mines by the look of it. Right. Okay, so... We have enough for us. Well, uh, maybe I'll uh, look at getting the Duckburg fuel refinery online. Yeah, that might be that might be the thing. Uh, right. I'm just scanning for it. Yeah, okay. So we've got a fair chunk of the uh, industry is uh, connected up to something here. Uh, so, yeah, I guess uh, the next, uh, next project might be a food processing plant. Maybe. Uh, yeah. We'll have to... We'll have to take a look. Uh, we have we have a food processing plant here, the San Angeles one. Um, so I'll have to take a look because, uh, yeah, uh, we definitely have uh, have some more uh, farms that we should uh, connect up. So we have a farm. We oh that no turn it this way. Uh, we have a farm here, one here, yeah, well anyway, I think that's uh, that's what we'll be uh, looking at, is a food processing plant uh, to get connected up, yeah, uh, and then, uh, uh, so I'm going to, uh, where is it, it was uh, at San Angeles, right? Where were we? We were... That's Dog River. Um, San Angeles. Over here. Okay. So I'm going to leave it focused on San Angeles here so that I can remember what I was thinking of doing. Oh, that's way off to the side. Okay. Uh... Okay, good. Uh, so I'm gonna I'm going to uh, do that, and then uh, oh yeah, there's uh, there's our stuff from uh, today up here. Okay, yeah. Uh, so I'm going to uh, uh, I think I'm going to uh, do this one here uh, next time around. Uh, once all the freight's up, maybe I'll take a whack at. Uh, building a couple of passenger lines but I think the map is getting a little bit uh, uh, sluggish and it might be uh, worth uh, uh, turning it in uh, you know putting it on pause or whatever and uh, moving on to a map that's a little less busy right where we can do a little bit more uh, uh, complicated stuff maybe a large map like this with you know a quarter of the number of towns and 
huge stacks of industry or something like that, right? Anyway, uh, I'm going to, you know, call it here. So that's going to be the end of this episode. Uh, and that's got the uh, construction materials industry on the map all connected up. So I guess uh, stay healthy. Uh, don't let the ongoing apocalypse get you down too much. And see you back next time.